<laughs> hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're returning thank you so much i really appreciate the love and support yo guys vlogging is so difficult it's been so busy ignore me if i look rusty but it's been so busy i've been looking for things and i also felt like vlogging while i'm looking for things while i haven't made a decision is just gonna make the vlogs unnecessarily long so yeah i've gotten to a point where i can finally show you you'll see in my previous vlogs that i was just literally looking for things the entire vlog um but yeah so now i have finally made a decision on the paint color that i'm gonna use for my boy's bedroom um, and then I've also uh, actually made a purchase which got delivered. I'll show it to you just now for my patio. And then, yeah, um, I'm going to start the boys' bedroom project in this vlog, hopefully. <laughs> There's just so many things happening in between. But I ask that you please, 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 please bear with me. Um, yeah, but I'll show you what I've got as we, we go along because I understand that the previous vlog was, vlog was literally just looking for things. And then great news, I am so excited. My headboard is finally done. So they are gonna be delivering it sometime this week. I am hoping that, and I'm saying sometime this week, but today is Thursday. So basically I'm hoping that they deliver it. <laughs> tomorrow if they don't deliver it tomorrow then it's probably only going to be monday but i'll also show you that process so let me show you what i got for my patio i bought swing chairs absolutely love them i'm so excited um i couldn't vlog while they were delivering them because i was in a rush i was in a hurry they delivered them on friday and that same friday was the same friday i was going to a women's conference in Bella Bella, so i couldn't really record anything yeah but i also asked the guys to assemble them for me so luckily they did that so i don't have to assemble them and then my kids absolutely love these things it just feels like we bought them for them um and i'm worried that they're gonna break them but <laughs> yeah we'll see anyway let me show you that and then i'll show you while i prep my boy's room um for painting i'm not gonna paint today it's too late it is it's already two o'clock in the afternoon so i'm definitely not going to paint today um but i will be painting in the coming days so i'm just going to prep like the actual design of what i want to paint on their walls and then i also want to paint their compactum as i told you before so i'm going to maybe like clean that just so when i'm ready to paint at least i don't have to clean it um but yeah i'll show you all of that in this vlog cool so guys these are my swings please ignore my shadow in the background but i bought these cute chairs oh my gosh and ignore the mess in the boys bedroom right i bought these cute little chairs a uh, swing chairs it keeps going around and around because it's very windy so i bought two of them yeah i bought two of them super super excited the kids really really love these these were on special um i bought them at uh is it cleo your i can't pronounce the name of the shop but i'll put the name the handle like on the screen um and they were on special from i think 4650 to about 2000 500 roughly for one so i i had to jump on their special especially because i've been eyeing these for quite some time i love them i do wish though that they had a little bit more cushion as you can see it comes with just one cushion um it's not uncomfortable to sit on right i just wish it had a bigger cushion that's more comfortable so i'm actually on the lookout for that to see if i can find cushions that will fit in the these chairs um yeah and i'm also hoping that if i do find like nice cushions it can be a plain color but i can then put like some sort of colorful um um cushion cover on these cushions just for deco purposes but yeah i absolutely love them guys oh my goodness Oh my goodness, my daughter comes out here every time she comes back from school to watch her stuff, her, <laughs> her tablet. Uh, it's so funny. And then when the boys are also up here, they argue. And they were telling me the other day, um, not the other day, it's literally yesterday, that I should have bought three of these because there's three of them. And I'm like, I didn't buy these things for you. <laughs> but yeah, I absolutely love them. Ignore the mess in, in the background, guys. But yeah. So that's what I bought. 
so just a quick life update yo guys like your girl has been going through it right and as a result i've decided to take a break from working i know it sounds so bougie <laughs> and weird but yeah i i decided to take a break from working and no it's not to do youtube full time i don't have that many subscribers hello if you're watching this and you're not subscribed please subscribe <laughs> but um I, I i needed to take a break because um you know a lot has been going on and just balancing motherhood uh you know being a wife being a a, a career woman yo like gunini gunini and it was getting very much overwhelming so i decided to take a little break from working um i want to call it a sabbatical <laughs> i'll call it a sabbatical for a few months so that's what i'm doing hence you're probably gonna see a lot of my vlogs are going to incorporate a lot of stuff around the house because i have been wanting to do a lot of things around the house but i just didn't have the time to be honest i never had the time so now <laughs> I've got the time <laughs> now i've got the time yeah um i also just wanted to encourage you if maybe you are just like me and you're feeling very much overwhelmed um and anxious you know you wake up anxious on a daily basis it's okay to take a break i think for me i was just so on autopilot for the longest of times that i got to a point where i knew that if i don't slow down my body is going to slow down and my brain is going to slow down and it's going to force me to take a break so that's exactly what i'm doing uh, but drastic yes um but i think it's exactly what i needed and I, I am so grateful i thank god that i'm in a position or me and my husband rather are in a position where i can take this break um and that's financially because we know in Cyril ramaphosa's economy we need two salaries to run a household, guys. Yo, But yeah, so that's the life update I wanted to give you. If you are feeling overwhelmed, if you are feeling anxious, I, I, I highly suggest taking a break. I'm not saying resign and stop working, but I'm, I, I highly suggest, you know, just normalizing taking breaks in between um, your, your, your busy life, you know, plan those uh, vacations, you know, just normalize having a lot of breaks in between because i think that was one of the reasons why i was very 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 tired but yeah anyway so guys also i did my hair i think the last time you saw me i had the other hairstyle so la lela yo okay uh it's it might look a bit raggedy now because yeah i went to a women's conference and i was in water etc etc but hello <laughs> hello hi i mean if you follow me on tiktok you would have already seen this but absolutely love the hair guys and i love the fact that um it's a mobile saloon like you give them a call tell them the hairstyle you want it includes the hairstyle the transport i mean the the, the hair piece you know even a wash i think they said but yeah i washed my hair myself so yeah i actually love these gatsby logs they're so pretty the lighting is bad maybe let me show it to you in this direction <laughs> guys am i the only one when i do my hair ne? i literally glow up like my skin just becomes anyway <laughs>
take a step out Get some in now, let your edge out Touch your eyes, but you'll be heavy in my mind Can you get the heck out? I need words now, drive me one though You so, you so, you Baby, baby, baby I've been on my empty mind, shit I try to get from you, so you Okay guys, so I've sort of um, taped out the areas that I want to paint. As you can see, I was going for this triangular look. Sorry, hold on, let me just move this. Um, there we go, so as you can see, As you can see, I was trying to go for this um, triangle-like shape. These are actually the colors I'm going to paint on each side. I'm going to paint this color. It's called C. C something. I'll show you the paints when I paint. But this is the color I'm going to paint on this side. Um, on So all, all of the places that I've taped out, that's where I'm going to paint that color. And then on this side, this triangle like corner i'm gonna paint this color um i forgot what it's called but i have the samples here so the sea wave sea waves is this one it's this one here this is sea waves and this is from i bought this at leroy Merlin. and then this one is called Wild, no, Wide Horizons. Uh, yeah. Also at Leroy Merlin. So, yes, I still have to finish this side. I just need to remove this compact term. Um, that's going to just finish the, the triangle on that side. And then this area is going to be this gray. But I'm going to use stencils to make small animals. Um, I'll actually... I'll talk you through it when I do it because it's not going to make sense now. Yeah, I was trying to get these lines very straight, but I think I'm not mad at them, right? I'm not going for perfection, um, but I just needed to look decent enough to my eyes. So, yeah, over there, because the wall is um, weirdish, I just had to just follow the, the lines, right? Yeah, and... I will show you once I start painting. It is a little dark because it's late in the afternoon. So once I start painting, in fact, let me see, what's the time? Okay, it's half past three. I need to fetch my daughter at four. So I think I'm just gonna tape out, um, you know, those bottom parts. I'm gonna put tape around them so that I don't mess it with tape. Um, just so that once I start painting, I can literally just get with it, right? Cool, and then I'll tell you the prices of the five liter paints that I bought. 
um hopefully it will be enough just for this section um and then i'll tell you the prices for those Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced Okay, um, I just wanted to show you this quickly. I'm out of breath, yo. Um, but I do have to leave now. I just thought, because I'm going to open it, I don't want to show it to you, save you leave. Anyway, so, and I had to go outside for lighting because it's quite dark. I bought these um, moist, uh, moisture... You know how to say it, Miss. <laughs> moisture absorber um, for my bathroom because, you know, when we're showering... It it's, gets very, 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 very wet in there. So I thought maybe I should try these and see how they work. Are they supposed to absorb um, the steam, I guess, from the shower uh, quicker? Obviously, we open the window, but like, yeah. So I, I'm going to try these out and let you guys know how it works or how it whether it's worth buying it. These I bought at Leroy Merlin. They were, let me check the price for you quick they were 36 rand so i will let you know how whether they work or not it says it lasts up to 60 days i'll also let you know if that's true but yeah basically let me try them out It's another day i haven't finished painting obviously <laughs> haven't even started um but it's grandparents day so i had to take tiamo's grandparents to her school for grandparents day and i decided to stop at a art gallery place which has sort of like a coffee shop a uh, breakfast place that yeah a place that you can have breakfast basically so i'm gonna just wait for them here um yeah while they do their thing there at the school so i thought maybe let me take you guys with me i am not sure if they'll allow me to vlog in the actual place because it is an art gallery place um but yeah if they do let's see <laughs>
www.thinkandgrowthpodcast.com. Hi guys, welcome to another day in the vlog. Yo, I haven't vlogged in a while, in like a couple of days. Please ignore the mess in the background. It is cleaning day today, so yeah. Anyway, it's a Tuesday. The past couple of days have been so hectic. It was literally impossible for me to vlog. Um, but yeah, so anyway, today I'm just gonna see if I can quickly go to China Mall. Um, and then I'm gonna go see a friend. I don't know if I, ish, I don't know if I have the energy for China Mall though. Anyway, so I thought, Oh, a skissini. My nose is itchy. Guys will be saying I'm picking my nose. <laughs> um, I just wanted to show you guys my outfit and then I'll see what I do. I still haven't painted the boys' bedroom. Uh, it's difficult to do it when my help is here. So I'm going to do it maybe tomorrow. But also, we are going away on a family vacay. So ish, I need to pack for the kids. I need to get a few things. Ish, so I, uh, yeah. Oh. But yeah, anyway, we'll see where um, this vlog basically takes us. Cool, let me quickly show you my outfit. Okay, so I'm wearing these earrings from this other shop, but I'm sure you guys know these earrings. You can find them anywhere. At some point, Lovisa had them. Then this, this jewelry on my neck is from Mr. Price. It's quite old. Then I'm wearing this pink shirt. It's literally a very long shirt. Um... And I bought this at Clara's Boutique. Is it Clara? Something like that. They have a brunch in Westgate Mall. It's actually a two-piece, so it has pants. The pants are just not comfortable for me, so I'm wearing these uh, jeggings that are leather. The belt is from Foshini. Um, and then I'm wearing... Ish, guys, I'm wearing Takis, cousin G. Yeah, I was going to wear sandals, but this shirt is too long. Um, so it needs a bit of lift from the ground for me. Anyway, uh, the jeggings are from, I forgot the lady from Instagram, but I'll put a handle, um, below, but these are quite old. So I don't know if you'll, you'll still find them. Uh, she sells plus size clothes. So yeah, that's my outfit. I think I look cute. Um, I absolutely love this shirt. Then for the bag, hold on, let me grab the bag. For the bag, I'm going to go with this bag from Aldo um a simple black bag i have been carrying these this bag guys but i yo i have been carrying this bag i love it <laughs> anyway we'll check you guys later hi guys so i just got back i'm so tired i'm wearing these shades because i wanted to show them to you they're so cute of course they look better when my eyebrows are done <laughs> but they're so cute from Frosini. how pretty are these um yeah, anyway, so I did not go to China Mall. Um, I ended up going to Power FM Studios to basically get my prize. I called in when they were having a segment on mother-in-laws. Well, okay, they called them mother-in-laws. It was a conversation around the relationship with the mother-in-love, right? And they had this lady, Gloria. Yo, I don't want to like mispronounce her surname right um they were she was on the show so as part of the i guess I, I i guess my comment was good so i won these two books this is the book i'm referring to um it's basically yeah about mother-in-law relationships with makotis and stuff so i'm curious to see what's in here and then they also added a bonus book hold on which is this one, um, Dearest Mariki. So it's a mother's journey through grief, trauma, and healing. I actually didn't know about this book, but yeah. So there's this book as well that they gave to me to read. So I'm looking forward to reading those. Yo, guys, Lalilani, I'm so tired. I'm tired. Ne? I'm tired and happy. And I have date night today and... <laughs> My daughter is so upset. Like she just she just can't understand why we have date night. Like why why are we doing things without her? <laughs> I think in her mind, ne, she was there in the beginning of the relationship. She was there, you know, like oh, wow. So she wasn't talking to me on the whole drive home from when I picked it up picked her up from school. 
she wasn't talking to me she was just like why are you going on a date why uh, what about me so who must take care of me and why are you leaving me yo <laughs> that's kids for you anyway so i yeah hubby and i are going for a date i'm so shining at chuluga it's hot today guys it is so hot uh, and i'm so tired i made myself ginger tea in this heat i know this is how i know i'm getting old but also i'm trying to think of whether i want to do my makeup for date night or not because it's either i do my makeup right now it's like five past five it's either i do my makeup because nah, our dinner date starts at half past seven so i have a choice do my makeup now or take a nap until six and then attempt to do a quick makeup face at six o'clock and as anyway yeah let's see how it goes i'm hiding the this label thing because <laughs> it has my address so guys while i was away i got a delivery and it's so funny because i ordered these things this morning and listen listen yellow sub trading does not disappoint because i i opted for overnight delivery and here they are they've delivered my stuff so let us quickly unplastic i won't say unbox let's quickly unplastic um, I'll put you up on a stand quickly so we can unplastic and then see um, if these things ish meet the expectation. I'm so scared. <laughs> uh, you know when you're buying something and you're like, oh, I wonder. But yeah, let's see. I think you'll be able to see me now. Um, let's quickly unplastic. Okay, <laughs> firstly, um, this is exactly the material I thought it would be because I wasn't sure if it's going to be stretchy or not. So, I bought this in a size double XL. It doesn't look as nice as it does in the pictures. I'll put a picture, but I think it will look better on my body. Yeah. This is fine. This is fine. I, I thought, man, this is probably stretchy material. I bought it for the dramatic arms. Okay. I'm not going to wear it now, guys. But when I do wear it, I'll definitely take a picture. Or maybe I'll insert a picture because I don't think this... I don't think this vlog will be up before I actually wear this. Okay. Then the second item is basically a, a it's like a done kind of tradition material. I bought this because my sister's Lobola negotiations are this weekend and I don't feel like wearing a chiki saya. Chiki is gonna be my backup. But I don't feel like wearing a chiki And then I saw this and I thought maybe this will work. And then I'll just cover my shoulders with a blanket because honey came out to Motswana. But yeah, I was worried that the material is not stretchy, so I got it in a biggish size. And obviously, yeah, I got it in a biggish size because I was really worried that it's not stretchy. I think it will fit me. And I think it will look nice. My daughter actually has a dress in this similar material, so I'm hoping I can find it and then me and her can be twinning. Uh, it's a little bit big. But I think when I wear it, it'll be fine. Yeah. It's so difficult to see these things when you're holding them. It's better to see them on your body. You know what I mean? And it comes with a dock. It comes with a dock. So then I can wear this dock and a, a blanket on my shoulder because it's one of my coaty brides. No, not bride because I've been married, but it's one of my coaty. <laughs> Yeah, so these are the two things that I bought. I bought this because I like this um, exaggeration on the curves. If you know me, you know I love my curves, right? I may be thick, but I absolutely love my curves. So I thought it would look 
could um but i was worried that since it's not a stretchy material that the fit might be an issue so i hope that i did a good job by getting a big size yeah that's all that i bought guys let me quickly take a nap i'm tired yo awesome. hi guys um i just quickly did my makeup um i used the foundation that i stopped using and i don't like the finish but anyway doesn't matter i I just quickly did quick quick chucks chucks. I feel like I need to do a bit of spray. Yes. <clears throat> yeah, I feel like I need to do some more of this. Hold on. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's going to help, but it doesn't matter. It's in the evening, so. <laughs> you know, when, when when you look orange or yellow, it's the lighting, by the way. But I'm like, it doesn't matter. It's at night. Who's going to see me? <laughs> Besides mommy and mommy and mommy. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Um, I am saying carefully. Let me see of wearing sorry hold on i am thinking of wearing heels my the heels i have are very uncomfortable so it's not make sure let me show you the heels so the heels i want to wear with this outfit are these ones from mr price um it's these sandals they are cute but not necessarily comfortable so ish do i want to be that girl today Will I be that girl today? <laughs> uh, let's see. Let me see. I have the shoes on. It looks cute, you know, but very much uncomfortable. Ish. I wish I could. Okay. I'm going to have to turn my camera the other way just so you can see the shoes. Ignore my toes, ne? <laughs> Not so comfortable.